Hi everybody, welcome to Plant Grower, where we can grow things because we like them, because we like to grow them, grow them, we like to grow them, grow them, we like to grow them. So today we'll talk about Ponderosa Lemon. I've had the mother plant for about six or seven years. It gives me a lemon about a few lemons every few months. It takes a while for the lemon to ripen. And once I get the seeds, I plant them, and usually takes about two to three weeks, and uh, these beauties come up. My germination rate is usually about 85 to 90 percent. This one here had an accident. I accidentally took the top off of it when I was transplanting it, but we'll see what happens. So I planted about 15 seeds and I probably got about 14, 13 out of it. Not everything in here is Ponderosa lemon. Uh, I have a row here of uh, yellow dragon fruit. That's this guy right here, all three of them. And then this one here is uh, Clementine. And these two are uh, lemons. It's kind of like a Meyer lemon, but not exactly. They're a little bit sweeter. I have the mother plant as well. Um, but Ponderosa lemon is actually a very easy and uh, nice looking plant to take care of. I just usually wait till it dries out, top two inches of soil, before watering it. And fertilize it uh, about every three weeks, summertime, and about every two months, wintertime and I try to give it lots of light. It sits right next to a window and uh, it's usually nice and healthy. So the lemon is actually nice and uh, juicy. I'll be doing a taste video in about uh, three weeks once my uh, lemon ripens. I have a few on the tree right now. Um, they're not ready to be picked yet. But they actually end out to be huge. Um, the size uh, maybe three baseballs, uh, maybe four. Sometimes they get bigger, sometimes not so much, but it's usually a big variety. Um, it's a heavy producer. Um, it's usually always got either buds or flowers or a lemon on it. Uh, so I'm really happy with it. Uh, but it usually takes about four years, uh, three to four years from seed for it to start producing. Uh, fruit but once it starts producing it does not stop it uh, produces the fruit year-round um, if it, it's got to be kept indoors but other than that it will produce fruit all year round um, as long as it's nice and happy if you look here you'll see um, some of the fruits that I have picked on it from the past and you can see comparison uh, to my hand it was really nice. Um, it's got nice leaves. It just looks really nice in the house. Ponderosa lemon was my very first citrus plant that I bought. And after that, I was hooked on buying citrus plants, any kind of tropical fruit plants, anything that's not easy to grow. Even though Ponderosa is super easy to take care of, um, produces nice fruits. Not too many people have them, or I haven't seen anyone else with it. Um, not even many stores carry it, but they're super easy to take care of, and they produce very nice and juicy fruit uh, with a lot of seeds. It's got a lot of seeds in the fruit, but it's it's well worth it because the fruit is just so giant. Uh, to germinate my seeds, I almost always use the paper towel method. So what happens is I will wet the paper towel, I'll put the seeds on it, and then I'll seal it in a Ziploc bag or a container and put it in a warm place, usually on top of a fridge. And in about two, three weeks, you will see roots and some green forming on it, and that's when I transplant them. Or you could just plant them in the soil and hope that they come up, but the way I do it, I know for sure if they're gonna germinate or not, because I only plant uh, something that's got root on it so it'll be 
a hundred percent. But if you have any questions, um, you can drop a comment below and I'll answer it um, to the best of my ability. But other than that, like and subscribe. Thank you very much. And as always, you can grow it and you know it.